Hi, right, today we're gonna demonstrate on how to, the proper way on uh, installing a PEX line onto a fitting. Uh, reason being is if you cut the PEX line wrong at an angle or something, um, once you install it on the fitting, it's liable to leak. Um, the whole PEX line will not catch on the ridges of the uh, fitting. Ahora vamos a demostrar cómo conectar una línea de, de PEX a, una, a un codo o algo que el, por, por ejemplo, porque si lo cortan mal en un ángulo, puede, puede fallar, puede tirar agua. Y nomás es muy fácil, nomás les voy a demostrar un poquito cómo, cómo instalarlo bien. Whenever you get the pegs feeding, it's very simple. Just make sure you make a straight cut. Like so. Make sure it's straight, not in an angle. And I'll do an example of wrong way to cut it. If you cut it in an angle, like so, see how that's in an angle, um, it'll be liable to, to leak once you uh, install it in the, in the fitting. So the correct way, again, is to cut it straight. La forma mal de cortarlo es en un ángulo. Si lo cortan en un ángulo, puede tirar agua y este no, no, no va a pasar inspección o va, va a haber mucha fuga de agua. Si la forma correcta es cortarlo derecho. So the right way is to cut it straight. So after you cut it straight, put your, your ring on there, make sure there's a little bit left hanging on top of the pex line. La forma correcta es, ya después de que lo corta, poner el anillo y que esté poquito salida para arriba. And after that, get your expander. Once you put it in there, make sure you rotate it to get even on all sides. Cuando ya lo, lo esté abriendo, está seguro que le esté dando vuelta al anillo y al pex para que todo vaya igual y se abra igual. Once you got it open all the way and you rotate it all the way, all you do is grab the fitting, make sure it goes in all the way to where it sits. Just hold it in a little bit and you're ready to go. Um, ya que lo abra todo, nomás meta el, el, el codo que siente todo hasta adentro y deténgalo un poquito y y asegúrese que ya, ya agarró, que ya amarró y, y va a estar bien. And like I said, just make sure the most important part is to cut it straight and uh, uh, make sure the ring is in all the way, just a little bit of gap that's sticking up and expand it and rotate your pegs line around when you're expanding it and put it inside the fitting. It's not hard to do, it's very easy um, and it's very simple and it, it won't leak this way. And the reason I'm saying to make sure it's cut straight because if you cut it at an angle, your pex line is going to be, you know, it's going to be in an angle here. It's not going to be covered up all the way up to the fitting. Así que es muy fácil nomás estar asegurarse que el corten el pex derecho. Si, porque si lo cortan chueco, el, el pex va a estar, le va a faltar un pedacito aquí y ahí es donde puede tirar agua. Es muy fácil nomás asegurarse que lo corten derecho y cuando lo estén uh, abriendo, que le dé vuelta al pex y al anillo y meterlo bien. Es todo. It's very simple, very easy. And that's it. Thank you very much.